Hello, today I'm going to be reviewing a program for Minecraft called the SKMC Launcher. It is not mine, it is someone else's. Uh, you can find it in uh, blogs on Minecraft.com. It is very helpful for all of you who don't know how to load or put in a mod for Minecraft. This is going to help you in a ton. Oh, I'm just going to start by clicking on it. Comes up pretty fast. Configuration default. So then you can switch this. Manage. Whatever you have. Fire the launcher. I didn't really mess with this. You can load the news. Start all options. All this stuff. Whatever. Whatever you want. Um. I'm guessing this would be for right here for uh, if you it's 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 easier to do a um, server on this. As you can see you can use a lot more space for uh, faster frames and whatnot. About Let's see, it's not mine. All right. Cancel that. Um, so now the reason why this is so much easier than actually putting mods under your regular Minecraft game is because down here you have three you can play add-ons, options. If you go into options, you get almost the same as a change as if you click on switch or whatnot. Click on add-ons, you get a thing like this. You want to say an active jar. So now if I uninstalled all of these. Well actually if you need if you want to put mods on this, you're gonna have to put in mod loader. And you just gonna have to download mod loader, put it in a folder and in one folder put all um put all of the mods you want in one folder and it's easy, you're gonna click install. Here's all the mods you can do. Well, n most of them, the thing is with this is that more complex mods, um, they don't work yet, but I'm not going to like brag on them for not working. It is hard to do it automatically like that, so I'm just going to leave it at that and say that this is really helpful. But, um, uh, here's my folder for all of this, alright, all these mods. Say I wanted to put Optifine, click on it, right there. It's easy as that. Okay, I want, hmm, what else is in here? Uh, time out. Oh, okay, easy as that. Um, hunting traps. Okay, easy as that, but you're going to need mod loader. That's the first thing you want on here is mod loader. Um, you see, you want a tornado mod. Um, this is one that doesn't work, which I'm pretty, uh, set. I'm pretty mad at this. I'm not mad, I'm kind of like upset. But you click on it, I don't know. Not gonna mess with it right now, but, um, gonna test it. Alright. Everything seems to be working well. And right here. Okay, single player. Let's see, play select the world. Hmm. Yeah. You want to come into the world. So you now it might be a little laggy for me, but my computer isn't the best. I'm not going to be reviewing the mods I'm using right now. I'm just showing you. This is a test, so maybe that's why it's lagging, kind of, but I'm not really sure. You can see, um, six items. You can see all the stuff I added in. Car. It's in there. Um, see, hunting traps. Very cool. Very cool one of people. Invisible pressure plates, fake grass, uh, everything I downloaded, everything I installed is on here. 
Xbox Live. Um, see, it's as easy as that. Most people go into your, your Java files, your Minecraft files, messing everything up. Sometimes it says Java cannot. Java cannot load this mod or whatnot because the meta p or whatever that file is called in your Java or in the Minecraft folder. This is a lot easier. If you have a computer like, <laughs> unlike mine, or faster, it's gonna be a lot easier. But it's always going faster. But yeah, very easy. Thanks. Bye.